Hello, it's Malcolm with Torch Chief for Malcolm 3D, and today we're going to be creating our own alpha decals. Please hit subscribe. I'm trying to hit 5,000 subscribers before the start of June. So let's right click, select, and delete that cube. Numpad 7 to go into top view. Shift A, let's add in a plane. I'm going to scale on the x axis. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to just kind of do a bit of a border. I, and let's go Control R to add in an edge loop. S to scale on the X axis zero to make that a straight line. Control B to bevel it. All right, so now we've got this, which looks pretty cool. However, I don't like the square. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna extrude that down. And now let's select all these corners. What I'll do is let's just come into side mode into wireframe, select all them. I'm gonna press Control B to bevel and let's just do a nice little bevel like that. So everything's got a rounded edge. And let's now delete this bottom half. Oh, over here as well, delete vertices. And we've just got some lingering vertices here. Delete vertices. There we go. And so now we've kind of got these rounded off edges. I'm just gonna add in some text, shift A, text, G, uh, let's put in Monta. What does that mean? I don't know. Quite frankly, I don't care. Let's <laughs> put that in there like so. Now we've got to set up the camera. I'm going to do Alt R and Alt G to reset the rotation and the location. G Z to move it up on the Z axis and then numpad zero. And we've got this. Now I like to just put it into orthographic mode. And now from here, we can scale it. G. What we need to do is make the white more white. So I will come into, I will select the object. Let's go to materials, new, change principle to emission. And let's make sure that's white, beautiful, material 001, material 001. Now, if I were to render it out now, background is gray. We don't want to have a gray background. So we need to come into the film settings or the render settings, film, change sky to transparent and F12. Beautiful. Now we've got a transparent. However, I'm going to be putting this on a little bit of a, on a spaceship on the side. So let's do a little bit of grittiness to this. So let's go shading, shift A. Uh, let's go texture. What do we got? Noise, sky. We can go Musgrave. I don't know. Let's have a look. What does the Musgrave look like? That's uh, a little bit yuck. We'll go noise texture and we'll put that in the color right there. So now we've kind of got these noise. Shift A. Let's go color ramp. And we'll drag this in, drag this in. From here, that's a little bit too big. So let's scale that in. Details. Let's give it some extra details. I think we could probably go even smaller. Um, I don't want so much black. So let's go the other way. I think that should be fine. Now, if I press F12, we've got black. We don't want black. So I'm gonna come over here into the materials property and change the blender mode from opaque to alpha clip. And now if I press F12, it doesn't work. And that's because my black isn't transparent. Now if I do F12, there we go. We can see that we now have an alpha. Once again, please make sure you like, subscribe and share the video. It really helps me out.